What began as a missing person investigation quickly descended into something altogether more sinister. Police began to understand that Vitalia had lived in fear for the last decade. If Vitalia had not left of her own accord, perhaps someone had forced her. Her ex-husband, he's crazy. And I think he's talking her. He tried to strangle her and... He just didn't know what was going on. I mean, the police were constantly in the house, was interviewing, asking them all these questions. For two days, the police had been working tirelessly, sourcing and examining local CCTV footage. We were never, ever going to lose sight of the fact that we could get Vitalia back. On the 16th of August 2011, four days after Vitalia had last been seen, a chilling image was discovered by the officers who had been trawling the hours of local CCTV footage, an image that reinforced the detectives' worst fears. The glimpses of Vitalia on CCTV confirmed once and for all that she had been snatched by her violent and obsessive ex-husband. Okay, Romantis. But ask him one question, where is Vitalia? He refused to help. What have you done with her? Romantis would not respond to the one question the police and his own son needed answering. However, his demeanor noticeably changed when officers mentioned to him the belongings they had secured from his home in Lithuania. We've got your wallet and we've got your sat nav. I even had officers piggybacking other officers to see how far you could get into that forest carrying a body. But she was nowhere to be found. The Polish police realized the potential connection with the female body they'd found in the forest months before. 